And right now tonight, a suspect locked up after a chaotic situation at a Westmobile apartment complex this morning. And tonight we're learning the suspect is very familiar with Metro Jail. Tyler Fingered is live in the newsroom right now. Tyler, this man took a woman and a child hostage, right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Witnesses are telling us we're, uh, we're told SWAT had to be called to get the suspect, 26-year-old Ladarius Cannon, to surrender. Now he's locked up, facing multiple charges. This viewer video is the moment witnesses say the police standoff ended as the suspect was put into the back of a police car. He had the girl and the baby hostage in the house and they got the girl out first and they got the kid out and then they got him out. Mobile police say they were called to the Lakeview at Cottage Hill Apartments for a domestic situation. When they got there, they say the suspect, Ladarius Cannon, barricaded himself in an apartment. It was pretty scary. I told my kids to lay on the ground because the cops had like big guns and stuff, so I didn't know exactly what was going to happen. So we were prepared for the worst. Cannon has had multiple run-ins with Mobile police. He has been arrested at least five times before today's encounter. Court records show in 2017, he pleaded guilty to a robbery charge. And in November of last year, he pleaded guilty to an assault charge. Back in Westmobile, witnesses to Saturday's standoff, happy nobody was hurt. And the woman and her child made it out safely. It was pretty alarming because this is a nice neighborhood, like really, really nice. My kids come out and play all the time. They go to the ponds, the playground, and it's never any noise over here. So it was pretty crazy. Police say the suspect is facing six charges, including unlawful imprisonment and making a terrorist threat. Live in the newsroom tonight, Tyler Finger, Fox 10 News.